Welcome back everyone for a naming ceremony. Cobra Kai Season 6 Watch Party. Season 5 left one major thread hanging. What will the combined dojo be called in the Sakai Taikai? They got in, but when it came time to pick a name, Johnny opted for Miyagi-Do. We are Miyagi-Do. In honor to his friend and rival, Daniel LaRusso. And However, Daniel we flinched. Are it's not just one or the other. What happened? You remember in season four, while combining the dojos, Daniel even suggested the name Miyagi. Bang. Just for today. Obviously, that was the fan chosen name for the combined dojos. I would have thought they would stick with that to the end, but clearly it's not the case. Eagle Fang was only ever a one off joke. Daniel really didn't like it, and he's not going with it. The real name of the final dojo is far more important. This has been teased for a while. Last summer, during the writer's strike, Netflix released behind-the-scenes glimpses that featured this dialogue. Victoria's dojos are immortalized, and for individual competitors, the sky's the limit. But before we throw our hats into the mat, there's one thing we need to do. Decide our dojo name. So we knew it was going to be a big issue, but the speculation only accelerated when Hayden Schlossberg confirmed the new dojo name would be revealed or decided upon in episode one. So the answer will come very early, essentially before anything else in the season gets going. What will it be? And then another important clue is something that came out recently from Sholo and Jacob. On their podcast, they mentioned that episode one was completely rewritten. They rewrote the first one, I heard, though. They rewrote the first one. Yeah, we yeah. had already filmed the first one. We're going to redo it. Certainly, the issues with the dojo name are still relevant, but other things moved around. I already explained how this was to make room for Hillary Swank to return as Julie Pierce. Perhaps the two are intertwined. If Daniel brings in Julie Pierce for help, she could be the third source for karate knowledge and ultimately the tiebreaker in the dojo name. While she was obviously trained by Mr. Miyagi, maybe she has her own dojo back home. Would they actually go with something like Pierce Karate? If Johnny comes to like Julie, he may be willing to go along with that. There are other possibilities, like Julie could use a name from the monastery where she first trained with Mr. Miyagi. Now that name was never mentioned in the movie, so they would be free to make up something completely new. It could also be inspired from the Japanese rock garden, where she learned to believe in herself. There are other possibilities that connect back with Julie, something to do with Boston, tea party karate? That sounds odd. Something with her school or Eric, or this old yard where they hung out? What do you think? It could also be something with all of them. Three senseis, East meets West karate. I think someone had that idea once. I don't think the ultimate dojo name will be something random the way Eagle Fang was. It will involve either Julie or all three of them coming together in some fashion. On that note, what if they called the new dojo The Karate Kids? It kind of works. It makes sense. It's got kick. I'd buy it. I'll see you at the next watch party.